Hello everybody, this is Victor from VStudio and welcome to another video. If you love taking photos and want your photos to look like a pro, then this video is for you. I will show you 5 simple steps to follow using Snapseed. So, let's begin! So, this is the photo I'll be using and in my routine of editing I will start with tune image by making small adjustments like brightness, contrast, etc. Here we have all the parts that we, we can change, like the brightness and simply slide to the left to decrease or slide to the right to increase the brightness. I will increase a little bit the brightness to plus 40, then the contrast I will pop a little bit, also the saturation not too much, the ambience as you can see change very very lot uh, this image, so 36 I think it's ok, pop up a little bit the highlights, the shadow decreased and the worm will be zero because we will change the white balance later on. We hit OK, apply and for the first part this is before and after with a simple tuned image. So the next step I, uh, I use is called vintage and for this image I will choose the filter number 10, we go to adjustments and adjust the brightness I think to minus 18, the saturation a little bit, bit pop to 15, the style strength just a little bit and also the vignette strength also a little bit then hit ok next I use grainy film I think this filter gives a better mood to the photo also you have here several filters that you can uh, you can use depending on the image that uh, you need to edit for this image i use x01 it's one of my favorite then uh, on the adjustments i get rid of uh, grain uh, because we don't need that and also the style strength i will decrease to 22 you can you can see it's very very subtle we hit apply then we will go to curves and here we have style and we can change by various filters as you can see excuse me So for this image I will use this one, I think this is good, you see it gives a little bit of mood, yes. After that we go to details, here we apply the clarity the structure I can zoom in to see better as you can see we don't want very very much just a little bit I think 16 is good and then sharpening also I think 27 it's good so, this is the final image, before 
and after. I think it's a huge improvement. What do you think? Let me know your opinion in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to share, like and subscribe. It means a lot for me. See you next time. Bye bye.